ऑफ सीजन प्रोडक्शन ऑफ मोरिंगा एज फार एज ट्रम स्टिक कल्टिवेशन इन इंडिया इज कंसर्न एटी परसेंट ऑफ ट्रम स्टिक वेजिटेबल्स आर बींग कल्टिवेटेड इन तमिलनाडु वेर द क्रॉप कम्स टू बेर ड्यूरिंग द मंथ ऑफ मार्च टू मे एंड ऑगस्ट टू ऑक्टोबर दैट टाइम द प्राइस ऑफ पॉट्स पर के जी वुड बी अराउंड फाइव टू टेन रुपीज पर के जी फर्दर द प्राइस ऑफ द पॉट्स वुड शूट अप टू रुपीज फिफ्टीन टू ट्वेंटी पर के जी ड्यूरिंग जून टू जुलाई एज द प्रोडक्टिविटी स्टार्ट टू डिक्लाइन नवंबर टू फेब्रुवरी दीज फोर मंथ्स आर मॉनसून सीजन फॉर दी सदर्न पेनिसुलर रीजन्स कंसिस्ट ऑफ तमिलनाडु कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश Royal Sima, Kerala, and Southern Interior Karnataka. In these regions, after November, the pods would be available in a very meager number in the South Indian markets. During November to February, owing to the season which coincides with heavy rainfall and low temperature, which leads to the drop in flowers, leading to poor pod set, which is considered. to be the off season period of the year in these four months south indian markets import drumstick pods from nasik region of maharashtra and baroda region of gujarat moreover the demand during this season is high due to religious functions with diwali ramzan christmas new year pongal etc apart from these there are marriage ceremonies and other functions in the rural and urban areas during this particular period that is from november to february the cost of the pods would be rose even up to rupees 130 per kg which is higher than the profits obtained during the glut period that is march to may and august to october as far as drumstick cultivation is concerned the production is not a matter or issue one can get good yield if he or she follows the proper schedule of water fertilizer and pest control without full knowledge one can easily get abundant yield in march and april in south indian states but gets only 5 to 10 rupees per kg in the market but the same pods can be sold in november to february for at least 50 rupees per kg how much yield one is getting in november to february is the matter getting yield in march and april doesn't help farmers economically keeping this in mind and the extra profits that could be given to the farmers in the off season production a study was conducted at our farm to induce off season flowering and pot set during november to february In this study the following treatments were imposed to induce flowering and pot setting of ODC3 moringa variety The following are the terminology Number 1 Sowing should be done between April to June Number 2 Germination will be started from the 10th day after sowing and pinching will be done when the plants reach 2 feet tall and subsequent pinching will be done 25 days after the first pinching this helps the tree to form an umbrella like shape which induces more branching followed by better holding capacity of the tree for flowering and potting number 3 the crop has to be sprayed with the chemicals 0.5% nitrobenzene at the rate of 2 sprays during the 70th day and 85th day number 4 the crop has to be sprayed with hb101 plant vitalizer at the rate of 2 sprays during the 55th day and 100th day number 5 the crop will come to flowering from 85 to 90 days after sowing number 6 physiological parameters like total chlorophyll content soluble protein nitrate reduces activity and relative water content had significant effect on the off season flowering induction and pot set number 7 the above combination of chemical spray would induce flower initiation by bud formation and onset of flowering 
नंबर एट दिस कुड इंड्यूस द ऑफ सीजन प्रोडक्शन ऑफ मोरिंगा ड्यूरिंग नवंबर टू फेब्रुवरी दिस फेच इज गुड प्राइस इन द मार्केट द रेनफॉल इफ को इन साइड्स विथ फ्लावरिंग कुड इंड्यूस ड्रॉपिंग ऑफ फ्लावर्स बट लेटर डेट्स आफ्टर फ्लावरिंग विल नॉट अफेक्ट द पॉट सेट एंड पॉड यील्ड नंबर नाइन flower should not be allowed before last week of september number 10 plenty of fym should be given as a basal dose number 11 flower can be induced by giving mild stress to plant that is stop water or give less water this activity should be done in the second week of september number 12 The first week of September, five to ten kg of poultry yard manure can be applied to each plant. This PYM generates soil heat, which helps the plant to flower. Number thirteen. All these activities to be recorded in your farm database with date. Even if you fail in the first year, you can succeed in the next year by adjusting the time.